Hi, kids. Hi, Mr. Bottle. Say, did I ever tell you how to make pets out of ants? No, Mr. Bottle. Want to hear about it? No, Mr. Bottle. I knew you would. <laughs> well, ants are the cutest things in the world. And they're cute anywhere. On food, crawling up your clothes, or just horsing around on the lawn. Now, some lucky people have them coming right into their home. But if you don't, here's what you do. Get a can of powdered sugar and sprinkle it all over the lawn. Now, mix up a batch of melted vanilla ice cream and maple syrup and start squirting the rest of the house. Finally, give the kitchen the works. Paint the oven with liquid candy bar and the table legs with guacamole. Remember, the more you use, the more ants you get. Before long, they'll be playing all over your house button their little heads together, rearranging your spaghetti, making your bed whiz around, and you'll be the envy of the block. You don't believe me? No. Oh, I knew you would. Next time, I'll tell you about a visit to one of the strangest places in the world where people say hello by choking each other. Bye, kids. <laughs> what was that furry creature going through your room? Well, that was my cat, Puffy. Cute, eh? Was Puffy an important member of the family unit? Actually, I think my mom likes Puffy better than me. Well... Puffy will not be dividing her affection anymore. Why? What do you mean? I am sorry, humanoid, but I had not consumed nourishment since Jupiter. You ate my cat? the time that Vernon Tudpuddle's alligator got stuck up a tree. His alligator got stuck up a tree? <laughs> well, it went up the tree to eat Mary Jean Bracegirdle's cat that was stuck up there in the first place. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you. 